Yeah. All right, let's do this. Hey, and then randomly chose uh, eight right. and we gave away Flip it the other way around. There we go. Sorry, one of your cards fell into my lap. I, didn't see. I am not looking. <laughs> that one's flipped around. <laughs> oh, turned around. Oh no! Oh no! I was trying not to look, so I wouldn't see. Well, okay, that's unfortunate. So I know what you're on, so let me tell you what I'm on. I'm on Cascade Balance. Okay. Cascade into Restore Balance. Oh, uh, sounds fun. This is not a good match for me, so you will probably win this. Oh, probably not, because I've never played this deck before. Okay. Oh, well, don't worry. If there's any deck in Legacy you can never have played before and be okay, this is, this is the one. Because I think I saw, I think I saw a Grim Lava Mancer, which yeah. means it's burn, which means that the burn deck that I donated to the store. Absolutely. Yes. Okay. So, uh, yeah, yeah. All right. So to see who goes first, let's just let me just roll on here. All right. Hey, finally. Thank you. Thank you, Die Roller, for giving me one. Did you hear that story about the police officer that decided whether or not he was going to arrest someone by using a Die Roller? I did hear phone? about that, yeah. You did it? That's crazy. Oh, no. Not again. Not again. I'll keep. This is a thing, I guess. All right. So, I, since I'm going first... I would like to go Esper into past turn. Wait, I could do it that way, because like I do run four. I'm going to go Epic Mountain into Ether Vial. This is not this is the deck that you you that you did. Oh no, no, no. Ether Vial is not in burn. What on earth are you playing? Well, it's goblins. Oh, it's goblin. Okay, okay, thank goodness. Because I thought for a moment that the decks they got mixed up and that Merfolk got mixed in with Burn. Yeah. And I was about to have a heart attack. Merburn. Okay, okay. That's fine. I am not. It's okay, okay, we're fine. It's okay. okay, we're good. Sorry, my, my ignorance is... No, 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 you're good. I'm, uh, I'm just glad that did not go as poorly as I hoped. Alright, so that's, that's a card we're okay with drawing, I think. No, 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 I'm sure. No, I think, I'm sure. I will play Geothermal Crypt. So, from now on, I'm just gonna name them by what lands they are, by what shard they are. All of them are gonna come in tapped. They're gonna make one mana of a given color. Like, for example, this one is blue. Or if I sack it and tap it, tap and sack, then I'll make one mana of each of its allied colors. So when I say Esper, that means blue is allied by white and black. When I say Jund, red is allied by black and green, and so on and so forth. So I have Esper and Jund in play, and then I'll pass the turn. Right. Tap, upkeep, a counter on this bad boy. Yup, that's a thing. And draw. Sweet. Ooh, I'm gonna play another ether vial. Ooh, okay. And I'll pass turn. As Evangeline would say, that can't be good. Can't be good. Right on time, buddy. Right on time. Not the matchup for you anyway, but right on time. Okay. Well, all right, let's see. How am I going to do this? Poorly is the answer in all likelihood. Poorly. I would like to... How many lands do you have in play? You have one. one. You missed a land drop. Uh, well, okay. Oh, but that matters. So on the one hand, that sounds bad, but on the other hand, you have two ether bottles. Yeah. So it's not the end of the world, I think. I think. No, it's not. No, 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 no. Maybe we want to be more careful here. He does, he does have that. Mm. Oh, this is, this is tough. This is tricky. How do I do this then? Um, okay. So one situation that does matter could be if you see a lot of life gain structures. Mm. So if there mm. are a lot of life gain structures. So that wouldn't do me any good. That wouldn't do me literally crazy. any good at all. Then there's a check. I think it's probably okay if I wait just a little while, just a little while, see if I can do something else after this. All right, we're gonna play an irrigation ditch, mm -hmm. so Bant, and then we're gonna pass turn. So I have Esper, Jund, and Bant. 
I have my favorite shard and sentimentally my least favorite shard because it was actually my ex's favorite shard. No, it's okay. Right on time, Goblin Lackey. Right on time. That's okay. That's fine. That's good. Then I will... You didn't want to put it in... Oh, that was your top deck. That was your top deck. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's maybe a better way to play it. No, no, no. That's fine. If that was your top deck, then that's... There's nothing you can do about that. Maybe Ether Vial, but then again, if I know your goblins, the only thing I'm expecting on one mana is Tarfire. Maybe Lightning Bolt. That isn't a goblin lackey. Okay, this is fine. It paid off because this was our top deck. So, admittedly, we got lucky, but if we didn't get lucky, then this was going to be our, our play instead. But it worked out, so we're going to go sacrifice everything. We're going to have one mana floating after all this, so we're going to, when I sack them, I get to make, a, again, two mana of each. So we're, after all is said and done, we're going to have one mana floating, and that one mana will be white. We're going to play a Deny Reality, and we're going to target the Aether Vial on two. Okay. Cascade Trigger. Would you like to respond to the Cascade Trigger? Yeah. Okay. And they're, they're in the graveyard at this point. I'm going to put this guy into the battlefield. Okay, got, uh, Mog War Marshal comes into play, makes a token. Here's your token. Spoiler alert, it's not going to last for very long. Uh oh. Well, no, no, that, that's on the field for now. Oh, okay. The Cascade Trigger has to resolve first. Gotcha. Yeah, but it's, uh, Tap. it's tapped in anyway. Okay, so is there anything else you want to do? Nope. All right, so Deny Reality, Cascade Trigger. Let's see. Oh, no, not the next card. All right. Well, I guess it's a thing. Restore balance. Uh, each player looks at the number of lands they control. I have no lands, you have one. And sacrifices them until they have equal to the lowest number. So, since I have none, you sacrifice your one. We do the same thing for creatures. Uh, you're actually going to keep this one, because even though you lose a token, you're going to get a token right back from Goblin, from Mog War Marshal's okay. yeah, effect. So when it leaves play, you also get a token, so you're about to keep a token. And then we did the same thing for cards in hand. So how many cards do you have in hand? You should have five. Three, four, five, yeah. Okay, I'm going to sacrifice a Restore Balance. Okay. Discard a Restore Balance. And now, now Deny Reality will bounce that back to your hand. Thank you. Gotcha. All right. Now... Pass turn? I will pass the turn. Okay, on Tampa, up a Keepa. And this seems really odd with the Ether Vial there on two. That's I may have just messed myself up pretty hard. But we're, we're about to find out. Translation, I just messed myself up. I'm going to go combat. Swing yes. for one. Hey, you might as well. Might as well. All right, you have me at 19. Then I will pass turn. Cool. Archaeological dig. That was obviously my top deck. This one either makes colors or one man of any color if I sack it. Pass turn. End your turn. Uh oh. Pile driver. Pile driver. Pile driver's good. It's modern legal, man. Yep. And I have made a horrible mistake. I mean, I w there was a lackey on the board. I was. I think that was the right time to do it anyway. I had a lackey to deal with. And I'll go ahead and put him up. Yep. Okay, so three. Draw. Three means we're going to deal with Discount Goblin. Right. I'm going to go to combat. Yep. Um, so it's plus two plus zero until end of turn for each attacking goblin. So yep, so I'm going to take right? four here. Ooh, a, a gold border strip mine. So five. Six. Beautiful. Beautimus. Hey. Is that right? Five, six? Uh, one. Two, three, four. Okay, gotcha. Yes, for each other attacking. No, he doesn't count himself. Gotcha, gotcha, okay. Yeah, so don't worry about that. That happens. All right, pass the turn. All right. Jund, pass turn. End of turn, drop a goblin. And turn, drop a gob. The hasty dude, yep. Yeah, dude, are you like looking at my hands? You're pretty good. You actually could have even played him on your turn, even though that's not normally how you play Aether Vial, because it would have given you one, two, three, four more damage. Mm. 
aware of the situation. In our right, so yeah. I'll keep that at three for now. Because he's not other goblins. You get, no, get I'm control of haste. Right. I'm going to keep him at the four. Uh oh. That sounds like Siege Gang Commander. And then draw. That sounds like Siege Gang Commander. And Siege Gang Commander plus Goblin Warchief equals Bad News Bears. Bad News Bears. So there, you play um, I guess we'll go ahead and put uh, oh. Goblin Ringleader in. Okay. All right, draw your four, or look at the top four cards. Reveal the top four cards. Reveal them? Yeah. Ooh, I see no goblins. I mean, you still win from here, but... So what do I do with these? They just go on the bottom. On the bottom? Yep. I could use any one of those, though. Yeah. Just one land. But it has haste. It has haste on its own. The land with War Chief. I'm gonna go to combat. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm going to go to three, and then I'm going to concede, because I can't win from there. Spoiler alert, I have two restore balances in the graveyard. There are only two in the deck, so I cannot win from here. Yeah, that's fun. It eats those for breakfast, my friend. Chain Whirler is a pretty good card. So, here we go. I would like to be on the play. Let's see if I can do it this time. Let's see if I can not suck. Ooh, this is actually a... Probably a terrible hand against you. Knowing what I know about your deck, this is probably terrible. But we're going to try it. I suppose. Why not? Alright. I would like to go Tinder Farm, aka Naya. Pastor. Oh, no, you don't. Force no. of Will, <laughs> pitching ardently. Fair enough. I will go to 19. Right. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> no, that. What a, what a, you know, what an overpowered card. But just, it's so good. Yeah. There was a time when it was much better, but dude, it's so good. So good. Uh, Jund, pass turn. Let's see what we can do here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Third Mesa, Pastor. Oh, okay. We have ourselves another land. Let's see. I would like to go. How many cards do you have in hand? I have six. Okay. Perfect. I will sack both of these. So we're going to make green, red, white, black, okay. not like those last two matter, because we're going to cast a Bloodbraid Elf. Ooh, yeah. Yay! Bloodbraid is going to cast it. Alright. Jund, Esper, Force of Will, Archaeological Dig, Crystal Vein, I'm doing a deck tech here, Bant, Bant, Bloodbraid, Crystal Vein, Force of Will, Archaeological Dig, Irrigation Ditch, Captured Sunlight, Gurmog Angler, Archaeological Dig, Restore Ba- Alright, so the rest of these are going to go to the bottom in any order. Okay. I'm going to make a Sacrifice Lands equal to the number of the, the kit player who has the fewest. I have zero, you have two. Sack two lands. Yeah, that is definitely not an instance for you to fetch. No. Um, a, the other way around, there we go. Uh, on the bottom. Um, and then the same thing with number of cards in hand. I, I have four, you have six. You'll need to discard two of your choice. Discard. Just two? Just two. All right. So All right. War Chief, Ringleader. hi -ya. hit you for three. You got it. And then I will play Jund, pass turn. Yeah, so this is how the deck plays, for better or for worse. We should have four. Oh, okay. That's a thing. On your upkeep? Uh, you need another mana. To, oh, okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to learn how to play that card. That's okay. <laughs> New to the card. That's what I'm doing. I'm your right. Esper. Uh -huh. Hit you for three. Got it. Pastor. Okay. 
Bloodbraid Elf, yay! It's a strong magic card, yay! Now we can start doing stuff. We can Wasteland or we can Rashad Import. If you have both of them, you probably Wasteland, unless you really need that second mana. I think I'm gonna waste, I'm gonna go ahead and Wasteland. Jund? Yeah. Alright, in response, float for black and green. Okay. That's it. Alright. I've got to pretend I have something. At least. Hey. Look at you over there. I'll play another Jund. Hit you for three. You got it. I like that restore balance. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. But yeah, past turn. It's a super janky deck, though. It's not actually a thing, unfortunately. Hit uh, the Okay. Right on time. Past turn. Okay. I think, I think it's not going to matter too much at this point. Yeah, to be fair, if you played that on turn one instead, I would have forced that. So. Yeah. Yeah. Three. You got it. How about. Restore balance. Not yet. We're getting there, but not yet. How about. Grixis. Past turn. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna tap upkeep. I'm gonna put one on. All right. Aether vial. Cavender souls. I'm gonna name goblins. Goblins. Yeah. yeah. That's a, that would be a great humans. That'd be great. Yeah. If you name humans, that means either Thalia or Containment Priest. Hmm. So Sting Scourger. Sting Scourge. Sting Scourge. Ooh. Okay. So bounce. I mean, but bounce it back to your hand. Do I want to bounce it back to your hand? I mean, it cascades, so uh, yeah. usually cascade cards are not great bounce targets, but if you don't want to die, and it does have haste too, so regardless of whether you bounce it or not, spoiler alert, it's going to hit you next turn. Okay, so I don't have to bounce, do I? You, it says when it comes into play, return target creature. You no, know, this one's not a may. It doesn't say you may return target creature. So I have to. If I play you would this, have to, have yes. To. Aye, aye. Well, I guess you could return itself, but that kind of defeats the purpose. Yeah. Yeah. I don't see any um, don't triggers know. that care about casting goblins, so no, probably not. Then I'm going to go ahead and pass the turn. All right. I just don't want to bounce a blood brain back to your hand. I feel like you're just going to get uber value on that. Yeah, you're not wrong. Hit you for three? You got it. It also has protection. And it has power, and possibly this has the ability to do a lot that's gonna get a creature out. Pass turn. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Go to two. Hey, we're we're going places. We're going places. Okay. I think we got. I think we can do stuff. So I believe you. I'm going to fetch. Yup. That you will. Go to four. four. Almost there. Almost there. I just don't feel good about this. Get a mountain. You couldn't see you two, but his facial expression was, <laughs> I don't feel good about this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'll call him back in a minute. I'm going to play Goblin War Chief. Uh, yep. Goblin War Chief resolves. Then I will pass turn. Okay. I will attack you for three. Chump. All right, fair enough. Trade. Yikes. Blue, green. Sack this one too, okay. I think. Yeah, yeah we're going to sack it too. Okay. All right. Um, Cascade de time. I don't know if this is a good play or not. It doesn't exactly have a way around combat. I don't know. Uh-oh. But it does have a way around Well, it's not on the field yet, so you can't sting Scourge. Okay. Right? Yeah. yeah, it's it's still on the stack. That the cascade trigger's on the stack. With the cat. Okay, gotcha. So right. cat, it's on the field. Spoiler well, it's not on the field yet. Okay. Spoiler alert, I'm uh, only gonna cascade into restore balance from this point. Yeah. Hello. Crystal Vein, Grixis, Naya, Bant. Hey! Balance. Woo! No one saw that one coming. So I have no lands. You have three lands. Now you have no lands. Have That's no how lands. that works. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. 
That's a tough day at the office. It is indeed. I still haven't played my land for the turn, though, so we're going to play an Esper and pass the turn. All right. Again, do I want to play that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I put this back into your hand. You have to. You can do. You can play another. Those lands come tapped. These lands come tapped. I'm yes. gonna try. Sting Scourger. Yeah. It's back in my hand. And then untap. It dies. It dies. Because you can't pay the four echo. Okay. Yeah, it dies. Okay. All right, now you'll draw. Or actually, we're gonna tick it up first. Tick up the we'll three. Draw. And then I'll draw. And then I will. Yeah, it's a two mana goblin bounce spell that that just. Dies. It's, yeah, it dies. But it's all good. I, sometimes it's great. If you can tutor it against something like Sneak and Show or Reanimator, yeah. where they had to like use yeah. their yeah use their resources. So I can bring in like a matron, flashing in. Yep. Matron into Skate Stink Scourger. Put my hand if I have another vial. I mean, I guess there's lots of options. Uh, I guess I pass the turn. We'll see what happens. Okay. I'm not dead yet. And by see what happens, that means we're gonna put a War Chief into play in just a moment. I'm going to play an Ancient Spring, tapped, mm. and we're... You're, you're in my hand. Okay, okay, you are in my hand. That's yeah. right. Oh my goodness. Confuzzling myself. I had, to, I had to remind myself that we were still in, in the clear there. I will pass turn. Alright, end of your turn. He has a War Chief. No War Chief. This guy. Matron. Hi, Matron. What are we going to go and get? I don't know. I think there is a right answer here. I won't tell you what it is, but I think there is a right answer. I don't know quite what your deck list is, but I imagine... Wait a minute. Is this actually your goblin list, or did you borrow it from someone? This is the one that I think you brought in here. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah this is the one. Okay, so I know the list. Yeah, I, I do. In that case, I think that there is actually a right answer. Yeah, human with base power and toughness. As best I can tell. Actually, that's an important point because well, it's base power and toughness. Transforming chromium doesn't change all of the buffs that you can have on it, equipment that you have on it. Let me pop it my neck real quick. It doesn't magically turn into a one-one. It will be a base one-one. I'm a little tempted to see how my most recent video is going. The Hitler doesn't learn the taxing probe is banned in Legacy. <laughs> You saw that one. It was hilarious. Yeah, I appreciate that. Thank you. Those may be some of my favorite videos to make, even though, spoiler alert, I make actual no money off of them. Yeah. I don't know what I get. I think I don't have any lands, so I have to get something I can buy a land. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's that's exactly right. So, but it has to be three converted mana costs. Three or four, because you're about to go to four with Ringleader. Okay. So those are those are basically your choices. But if you go to four, you basically only get Ringleader. I think you actually only get Ringleader. I will pass the turn. All right. Yep. Now let's see if you picked what I would have picked. I picked. Let me tell you. No. Well, I mean, you're about to find out in just a moment. Oh, I guess you got to combat then. Well, you got to draw for your turn first. Oh, okay. you did the end of turn. Sorry, it's been a long day. Would you like to take it up from your upkeep? Yes, I'm gonna okay. take it up. I'm gonna take. Oh no, I'm not gonna take it up. Okay. So I, didn't, I didn't probably drew. The, I probably didn't draw the right thing. I will go to. I'm gonna violin Goblin War Chief. Yep. And then I'm gonna swing for three. Yep. That's correct. Pass turn. Is that the good? Was that the right choice? I. I won't say. I, I don't know. I will play Crystal Vein, mm -hmm. the soul land of the deck. I mean, I guess they're mostly soul lands. Hmm. You're not having problems getting land. No, okay, no, this deck can do that. It it certainly can. I'm gonna say pass turn. And at 16, I'm expecting to be at a virtual 13. There's a land. Either vile. Woo! Ah ha 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 ha. Generals in just in general are are bad. Like if I see six or more, let's you see. Know, Force of will, pitching, deny reality. I'm gonna go to fifteen for that. 
basically never happens, and certainly not for one that has to attack because then you're because you're already at three. I don't want you to get any for it. Oh, we're just getting an actual factual gym palm incinerator out. That's insanity. Like I don't. Wow. Feels. Okay, well, I'm, not cycling it, so. I'm in trouble. I better hurry. I guess I'm swinging five, though. I'm at ten. I did not realize that force of willing that put me on an extra... put me down a turn for the clock. Past turn. Top decks, please. That is not a great top deck. That is not a great top deck. I will pass the turn back to you. That is really not the top deck I need. No, notice Josh is right. changing a little bit when he's talking about drawing cards and operating at flash speed. Alright, I'm gonna go to combat. Yep. And yep. swing for five. Uh, but, but okay. Pass turn. Have lower costs because you need to play the general, then play the thing on top of it. Yeah. So you need to have something low, and then you build up on top of it. Good and games. So I can play the land, but it comes in tapped, and so while I have six mana, I don't have seven for Chancellor, and I don't have quite the right colors for Captured or Shardless. Good games. Good games. Chancellor would have been a... I would have liked that. Uh, super scoop on my part. <laughs> well, your Vile will play against the counterspell side, and yeah, you don't have Cavern yeah. as well. That would have been nice, but uh, just the fact that it's a 5-6 blocker yeah. turn after turn would be would be pretty good. And what I had was a uh, Marshall, which is kind of dead in my hand right now. Mm. And then, But I did have the Ringleader, which I would have, on my upkeep, Oh, yeah. yeah. Now, if I had, on the other hand, if I had discarded to force a will, the Shardless Agent instead of the Deny Reality, then I could have played Deny Reality on the Aether Vial and tried to Cascade in stuff. In which case, let's see, I get Captured Sunlight into... Shardless Agent, which, yeah, that's that's that. As it turned out, hindsight is twenty twenty, of course, but that would have ended up being the better play. Fun games, thank you for for, uh, for playing. I oh, appreciate it. No sideboard for me. I think against goblins, I'm fine in the main board. Although it didn't work out that game. That's a number of times now that having only two instead of three restore balance has has KO'd me. So I need to consider looking into three. I think. I think.